would just recommend uh, people to him. But he insisted on, you know, making me a member of Lifeway. And the rest is history. And I am so grateful to him for, you know, uh, introducing me to Lifeway. And he is my direct sponsor in 2018. So we've been in this journey for almost five years now. Thank you very much, Frank. Lapit na. Uh, sa November ka. Ako sa August, magpa five years na ako dito. Uh, hello, okay. have you made me a share screen? Can I share screen now? Yeah. Let me try that now. Yeah, do that. All right. Oh, there it is. Okay, thank you. Okay, so uh, before we begin today, for those people who still don't know me, this might be worth something for you today. But for most people here, half of the people, the names that I see here probably already know and have heard my story. So this is just an updated story of uh, my journey here in Lifeway. So um, my name is Anthony Franklin and uh, I have uh, uh, attained the rank of executive director three years ago working on qualifying for a presidential director and uh, your Life brand, uh, Lifeway brand partner. So, uh, upon graduating from the University of Santo Tomas, which is the oldest school here, like you, uh, Marivon, I also graduated from the College of uh, Architecture and Fine Arts uh, in 1986 with a degree in BS Architecture. I've never experienced any form of employment because I had envisioned a lifestyle free from a boss with unlimited time freedom, even during a time of job scarce, uh, security way back in the 80s. I became a jaded financial planner and businessman, but still found myself in financial trouble even after decades of hard work. And I realized I was older and stressed, desperate. My self-esteem was challenged. I realized I needed to look for an opportunity that had a legit leveraged business model, and that is MLM. So three companies later, from the first one that I joined in late 2013, I finally found my happy place, which is obviously here in Lifeway. I invite everyone to explore what has completely transformed my life and those around me. So prior to joining Lifeway on August 11, 2018, you would see some uh, screenshots of posts that depict the way I feel, felt in the years before Lifeway. So you can just read through it, no? So I was driving a 10-year-old second-hand worn-out Toyota Revo. I was able to force, you know, some short budgeted trips around Asia and once in the U.S. loaning from my daughter. I could not break through even through decades of hard work. Through, though I'm able to meet my obligations, I had no savings in the bank. Nothing. So like most people, I too had similar hopes like, you know, anyone here in this uh, Zoom right now. I wanted a brand new car, a roof over our head, to see the world, to live comfortably, away from stress, to share with others our extra blessings. No? Yung makapagtulong, makapagambaka, pay it forward to the society, which has been, you know, lacking in, you know, government support. So fast forward to the present. I have fully paid my brand new Toyota Altis, you know, in full, three months ahead. I've invested in a property in Alviera, in Pora, Pampanga. This is near the Clark Zone, no, the Freeport Zone. And recently also purchased two unique condominium with a parking slot from Mega World uh, in, in King Square. No? This is in Manila. I've taken my daughter to a trip to the United States in 2019 and recently uh, across nine countries uh, in Europe. We're planning to move out of the country again uh, towards the end of the year. We're still planning on that one. So I was able to place some investments as well uh, to serve as a buffer and uh, to grow my my hard uh, you know my hard earnings and bless others in timely and meaningful ways. I help people that uh, cannot repay me, and uh, I, I love doing that. So looking forward, I look forward to many more similar, bigger, and better life transforming uh, stories coming from you. Kayo naman. It's not all about me. This is all about you. So this is my timeline after graduating from the UST. In July of 1985, two years before I graduated, uh, one year before I graduated, my dad passed away. He was very happy 
to see me doing the drawings, no? And, uh, well, hindi niya naabot yung aking graduation. My mom barely made it. So, after I graduated, she passed away as well on the same year, uh, a year after. So, halos magkasunod lang sila. In April of 1987, yung inheritance ko that was left to me by my parents was denied to me. And I was disowned by my brothers. And in January 2000, oh, year 2000, Y2K, I had a complicated marriage going on at that time. And uh, two months late, uh, a month, no, no, February 2001, 13 months later, stressful annulment proceedings began. No, nag-upisa na kami mag-file charges against each other for an annulment. So the, my son diagnosed with acute lymphoma came in Feb of 2005. Four months later, pabilis siyang nawala and he passed away um, about 18 years ago. Feb 2010, my credit cards were piling up debts and yung mga utang ko sa tao, hindi ko na rin mabayaran pa. Pero nakikiusap naman ako at naguhulog naman ako. So, uh, Feb 2014, I joined my first I joined my first of three failed MLMs in succession yan, ha, before LifeWave. Halos masira ka na ng bait. Drained na talaga yung pocket. Wala ka ng kumpiyansa uh, uh, sa sarili. Uh, this was real devastating. September 2015, my secretary runs away with 250000 of investment placement coming from a client who connived with her, uh, Tinakbo Nila, and this resulted in my insurance company threatening to file a case against me and to void my uh, insurance license, my financial planning uh, license. Lahat ito ang hirap talaga. August 2015, Four people who owed me money na hindi sana ako talaga nagkaroon ng mga uh, hardships as far as uh, financial matters are concerned, uh, defaulted. So, hindi sila nagbayad. Recently, may isa na namang hindi nagbayad. And uh, it's really quite uh, uh, isang lesson na hindi ko matutunan yung magpahiram sa tao tapos hindi ako binabayaran. But, you know, that's my weakness siguro. But I will... I will uh, try to correct that from now on. So, pag ganito ang dinaanan ninyo, na wala ang tatay mo, na wala ang nanay mo, na loko ka, uh, na wala anak mo, uh, anong gagawin mo? Kaya pa ba? And so, it, again, I came up with some more posts uh, that I uh, posted on Facebook years ago. And I just kept my faith and my focus and consistency because I believe that the way out of this one, my financial crisis and a lasting solution to everything that I've been through is through network marketing or MLM. So I think continuation of in timeline, in July of 2018, I was introduced to LifeWay and then I joined a month later, which is August 11, 2018. Feb 2019, nag na, no? Barely... Three months after uh, LifeWave opened shop here in late November of 2018. So August to November 24, wala pa din tayong mga online services or inventory here in the Philippines. We started November 24 of 2018. So three months later lang, nag-uumpisa na ako, makakabayad na ako. And my smaller obligations were the first ones that I addressed. And in March 2019, with just 37,000 in my bank, again, another distributor, Jackie knows that person, scammed me of 20,000, more than half of it. Hindi na binayaran. And September 2020, my ex-wife passed away. Yung mama ng mga anak ko. In April 2022, all financial obligations were settled. Credit card bills written off on statement dates. Pag inisyo na ako ngayon, nagtatanggap ako ng text message ngayon from, the comp uh, from let's say, Citibank. Uh, or BPI, I pay it right away in full. No? So, ang malila kong spelling ko, walang abanda niya, nagkamali lang. So, success leaves clues. May the good Lord abundantly bless you too. These photos aim to symbolize my financial struggles prior to joining LifeWay because I have envisioned my life from the get-go. Here is where our and many lives will change. I was here on the same day uh, beside Hero, uh, Jeb, uh, when David Schmidt came here for a second time to grand launches uh, in, in um, Manila Pen, 
Ito po yung suot ko, sirang sapatos ng Skechers, but still very comfortable. And my Zara uh, blazer or overcoat na may yung nang ano, punik sa likod, I didn't even notice it until uh, the time I got there. Uh, when I noticed it, I had to button my my ano my uh, blazer kasi nakakahiya na makita yung laylayan ano may may punit. So this is a picture or slide that I always look uh, I always go back to to remind me to always keep my feet planted on the ground. At dahil sa masidhi ang pangarap ko. Hindi ako makakapayag na walang mangyayari o kahihinat na ng lahat ng pinagdaanan ko limang taon na ngayon. Sa mga pinagsikapan ko, sabi ko nga, I did not go this far just to get just to get to this uh, to this uh, place. No, I must write my story compelling enough to make a difference in the lives of those who can relate to me. Right now, uh, I talk more about my story. If it can relate to some people who are in the same boat as I was, and you want to fix it, I can help you. Sira ba yung laptop mo ngayon? Wala ka bang matinong mobile phone? Wasak ba yung kotse mo? Those were my realities five years ago. And I can perfectly relate. Wala, bagsak na ba yung ano mo, bank account mo? Tapal system ka ba? Sa utang, I can help. Why? Because I've been through that. My success story is different from most because it came from below zero. No? Hindi ito yung Meron lang may, may, may puhunan na or something. This one really came from a negative uh, perspective, no? negative balance perspective. So for those people who are having a hard time, you know, uh, making ends meet, I might be able to help. I say I might. It depends on you pa rin. So ito yung mga 11, actually more than 11 na ngayon, uh, highlights of my career. Here in Lifeway, the first one, number one, ito yung nagtap ako. Eh, kami lang talaga ni Sabil noon eh. So, talagang magtatap kami sa Lifeway. This was during the grand launch in March 16 of 2019. The car that I uh, fully paid up for already, it's brand new. Hanggang ngayon, wala pang 15,000 ang mileage niyan. Halos talagang baby pa yan. The gold coin is number three. This is one of only 12 in the world. And uh, one of these coins are uh, is sitting on the table of uh, Donald Trump. Kasi gusto ni Donald Trump itong gawa ni David Schmidt. He was introduced to uh, Donald Trump by Thomas Burke, uh, a long time a pioneer SPD here in Lifeweight. So on the Bahamas Street, we cruise kami, and then nakapag buffer ako sa RCBC ng uh, konting investment. I've been there like three times already, so tat- nakakatap yung patong na ako. Tapos sa uh, number 7, uh, I was able to visit LifeWave so I can see for myself how big and how real this company is. I've been there and uh, wala na akong kaduda-duda talaga sa kumpanya ito. Then in num- uh, number 8, ito yung lote namin sa Alviera, malapit dito, sa likod ng sign na yan actually. Number 9, ito yung sa Mega World na binili ko. Uh, at number 10, ito yung... Uh, Ano namin ni uh, David Schmidt, TV feature over GMA. This was also in 2018, December 2018. So, on my 60th birthday last April, I gifted myself by traveling out-of-pocket. It's not an incentive trip. It's just an out-of-pocket expense or investment or dream come true with my daughter and best friend when we went to Europe. Among the places that we've been to, Italy, Austria, Liechtenstein, Netherlands, or Holland, Switzerland, Belgium, Germany, and France. And probably in the US or Canada towards the end of the year or uh, somewhere else. Wala pa. Uh, Tokyo, Japan, uh, plan pa rin to. Kasi this is a slide that I made in May. No? So, you know, things are kind of uh, fluid. So, we're still looking for where we're going uh, towards the end of the year. But definitely we'll be out of the country. So these are some of the pictures that were taken in Europe. Had a great time with people that I know. Uh, a classmate of mine who is a top uh, officer in the United Nations just came to see me. Another friend of mine who, who works also uh, in the uh, United States government embassy came to see me. Ang saya lang, no? I mean, meeting people. 
anywhere you go out of the country. And I wish uh, si Miss Araneta, sana namit ko kayo sa Italy had I known you already during that time. Sana kahit ilang oras nagka, ano tayo, nagkaniit tayo na. So this is 2026, what's in the future? This is the property in Pora. We'll be uh, moving in there. And uh, this is still a property in Think Square also in the same year. Turnover 2026. This is how it looks like inside, your model unit. And I might just change a little bit of this one to create more room. Everything happens for a reason. Everything starts with a compass. Why do you do what you do? Do you know why you do what you do? My big why is my daughter. No one else. My big why today, nadagdagan na ng pangalawa, is hearing your stories. It's listening to you guys. Come up with your stories. If we have more face-to-face -face events, go up to stage. I want to see you doing Zooms. I want to hear your stories from others. And, and you know, uh, it's just a beautiful thing to see people lift each other up, not drag each other down. So this is a timeline for the Philippines. It was July 24, 2018, when I had a private call with uh, David Schmidt, uh, facilitated by my sponsor. Our friend SPD Georgia Tan and uh, Hero was also on the same call that night. Di pa kami magkakilala nun. And then December 18 was the first time David Schmidt came to uh, pre launch or soft launch our company here in the Philippines and grand launch us three months later. Actually, this is the second and third time that uh, David has been here because he's been here 2010 and he met up with TV personality, uh, Cory Quirino, who is now the head of the Binibini Filipinas. Cory Quirino happens to be my very first distributor on my uh, left side, no? left side ng akin binary. And um, with this, I hope to hear your stories uh, in the future. Uh, this is not about me, this call, this is all about you, to see if there's something I can help you with, no? and that we can lock arms Remember to keep your feet planted on the ground, reach out for, uh, reach out to the sky, pray hard, and believe in your dreams from within. Uh, this is all for now. Thank you very much, and uh, turn it back now to Marie, uh, Director Marie, or SD Jati Rabago. Thank you for the privilege uh, to speak to you today about my my, my story. Thank, thank you, you, thank you, Frank. Frank, uh, let me just uh, say something uh, to everyone. Um, Frank and I, uh, we've been together in another different MLM companies, company, and that's where our, our, you know, acquaintance started. And from that time on, uh, we get to, you know, bump to each other in the office. Um, and I was so, you know, uh, somehow touched when he called me one time and asked me to meet, meet up with him in uh, Robinson's Malate and just to share what he has on his hands. And um, although at first I really declined, in uh, accepting his offer for me to be a member of LifeWay. But he was so persistent and, persistent and even in uh, when I joined um, Julian, uh, Julian's uh, generosity, I was able to sign up uh, December 5 of 2018. And um, we we started patching in the Philippines, the three of us. Uh, one is a director, Isabel, and him. <coughs> and uh, the rest is history. I never imagined, you know, uh, lasting this long with LifeWave because also obvious uh, recently the last few years he's been mentoring me although the first two years we were not really um, uh, working together as close as we were we are right now and Sabina saving the best for the last and I really appreciate everything that he did to all our, to all the teams in the Philippines he was our really our mentor he was the one uh, who really started the the webinars okay uh for uh, for the first 10 directors so for that yeah. we would like to uh put together let's put together our hands for frank we owe hey. him a lot hey. for who the senior one of philippine life wave excuse me this just came in somebody who i don't know message me i'll just read huh? it na lang. it comes from paulette i think she's on the call now she, yeah so right yeah now. sabi niya hello yeah. po Thank you for sharing your story. I can relate and I'm blessed to be able to hear it. Nabuhayan po ako ng loob. 
pag mapasyal kayo ng Japan, sure, sure ball yan. I would love to be given the chance to meet you. I hope you don't mind me sharing your your message to me, Paulette. Uh, but these are the kind of people. These are the kind of people I heart. These yeah. are the kind of people I love. Rami salamat. So she's here and she's my daughter Paula, I think. Yeah. Kaya Paulette, kaya Paula. Yeah, Paula and Paulette. <laughs> they are beautiful people. Really. Of course. They uh they uh they are from our Philippine Japan team. I think they yeah. were they were able to meet our SPB hero when he, he was in Fukuoka. Am I correct? So uh, thank Marie, you. Can, 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 uh, can we uh, can I add something? You know what? Uh, for the in the last five years that I've worked with uh, in LifeWave, this is the first time that I heard uh Edi Prankton humbly sharing his story. Because people look up to him na very complicated person, na very high high polluting, no. Magaling kasi talaga si Frank eh. Magaling mag-English, magaling mag-sulat. Magaling no, no, mag-yan. no, 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 no. Cut it out. Cut okay. it out. Okay. Alam mo, ngayon ko lang siya narinig na from that, uh, I'm really teary-eyed kanina when he was sharing his story. Kasi nararamdaman ko yung sincerity niya talaga to help. But, you know, some people just uh, don't see him na the way I see him as a friend and as a mentor. So I hope everybody here will give Uh, him a chance to really share with you his talent. He's really a talented person. And I've learned so much in the last two years that we've been, we've been working closely now. Uh, sa kanya, ang, mga, ang team ko po, grabe ang natutunan sa kanya. And maraming maraming salamat, Fran. So, uh, I cannot say any more. Uh, words will not be enough to express my gratitude. He is, no doubt, SD Jati, E.D. Franklin is a mentor. Okay? And he always reached to us uh, through his heart. Uh, I can't even forget uh, in in my very first web Zoom with uh, LIG, he was there and then I put a comment on the chat box and he told me, uh, Marie, if you need help, just just message me. I'm just a message away. I, I still have that ED Frank and I am, I am very thankful. So that's how he is, you know. So I think each and every one of us here in the room were 39 and we were touched by It's his 39. story. We were inspired <laughs> by his sharing. Earlier, we were 49. Okay, so as yeah, I prepared... We were 49 earlier. Things, we were 49. X-49, so kanina. Cannot, yeah, now we're X-39. <laughs> I cannot erase those names. I cannot delete those names because the wheel of names have been prepared earlier while we're doing the yeah, testimony. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I just don't know how to share it. So if ever we call the names and they're not here, well, I am so sorry. Okay. But now we're 39. Okay. Moving back. Uh, we, we, we were all teary-eyed by those sharing. Uh, thank you again. Thank you, Rod. So how are you?